Tokyo Art Book Fair right now. I'm waiting to enter because I'm going to see my friend and we're gonna meet up and then we're gonna go around. I think we're gonna have tonkatsu tonight, so that should be pretty fun. I just met up with another group of friends visiting from Manila. We walked around Nakameguro and that was also really fun. So it's just nice being able to see friends that I haven't seen in like years and then just hang out around Tokyo. So yeah, that's basically where my head's at. <laughs> I thought we were hardcore bread lovers, right? This is... my god. Yeah. holiday here in Tokyo, well in Japan, and I decided to just go out and bike, Shogo has work today. Your destination is on the right. Oof, yeah, I'm here. <laughs> I just wanted to go to a cafe and read a book. I'm trying not to drink lattes anymore because it's just so much milk. Um, but the one, the beans that I got were from Honduras. I asked her what her recommendation was, and this is what she recommended. And I'm trying to reread Pachinko. I feel like I was a really different person when I first came to Japan, and that's when I first read it. And now that I've been living here almost three years, I feel like the perspective has changed, and it would just be nice to read it again. So, yeah. 
just relaxing. It was really nice just spending time by myself doing whatever I wanted. I will give you a thrift haul when I get back home because the thrift gods bless me. Hi guys, it's been a really long time, maybe two weeks since I've last like sat down and talked to you and just, I don't know, had a little heart to heart which I normally did in my previous vlogs but yeah. Anyway, I just wanted to talk about how it's been since the borders opened. I feel like I have so many friends heading into Tokyo, heading to Japan and it, it's just been really good catching up with all my friends and because of that, this week's vlog is a little quieter than my other vlogs. I think on Saturday, I met up with some friends first in Daikanyama. I brought them to Ishin, which is where Raisa like, brought me this one time. And ever since then, I've been bringing a lot of other people there. And then in the afternoon, I went to Tokyo Art, Tokyo Art Book Fair. Um, at the museum I've never been to before. It's somewhere out in, I think, Edogawaku or something. I really like graphic design, so it was really fun seeing all these different artists from all over the world bring their art, show their zines, and yeah, just have it on sale and have people support them. I feel like it was just a really great environment to be in, and I hope that I can catch them next year again. On Sunday, I introduced Raisa and Bella for the first time, and honestly, every time I try to mix friend groups, I feel a bit nervous because I don't really know if they're really gonna get along or not, but they got along perfectly, and it was so much fun. I had no idea that the Bread Festival was going to be as popular as it was, like the line was so long, it was worse than any Tokyo Disneyland um, line that I've ever seen. Um, but yeah, it was really interesting and hopefully next year we get to go inside this time. So yeah, just lessons learned. And this week for work, we shot a new segment for our Gaijinpot YouTube channel. Um, I'll link it in the description if you guys want to check it out and please subscribe. It's very unhinged, it's just very fun. I appeared in a video with my co-host Shelly for Combini Comparisons where we compare one item from each convenience store nearest our office. And yeah, so this week we did something different. We did something with Laura from a different team. And we tried Japanese makeup trends for eyes and um, this thing called the Dysoverse, which you'll see in a later video perhaps. And I'm just grateful that I found this company and that I was able to become regularized and meet all these amazing people. I really just enjoy it. And I feel like I'm really thriving, is that what you to say? Um, and yeah, yesterday I just had a day alone. It was nice going on my bike, just going anywhere, no plans really. I was also blessed by the thrift gods, but I'm washing my clothes right now so I can't show you. Maybe I'll show you in the next video. But yeah, so far life has been really good and I just hope it keeps on like this. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys have all been well too. I'm really sorry if this week I wasn't so chatty in the vlogs. I feel like I should be chattier. Um, I'm trying. I'm still trying to get over my shyness, if you can believe that or not. Um, but yeah, lots of exciting things to look forward to. I hope you guys are always doing well. Please just share whatever life update you have in the comment section, because I really enjoy hanging out with you guys. I'm sorry if I sometimes reply late, but anyway, yeah, that's it. I'm talking way too much now. But yeah, thank you guys so much, and I will see you next week. Bye.